if you're into DeFi and know what it is, and you know also what the multi-chain yield optimizer, Beefy Finance, is, you'll probably be interested in the news from the 29th of July, 2023, when Beefy stated that this therefore means the collapse of our Beefy token as we know it. So the token for Beefy Finance, known as Beefy, has basically halted and they need to migrate the whole token to avoid a complete collapse of Beefy Finance. I will include a link to this article in the description below so that you can give it a read. But let's look at exactly what happened here and what went wrong for Beefy. And it all starts with multi-chain, which is a cross-chain router, essentially for swapping and bridging. So firstly, multi-chain, the company multi-chain, put out a tweet on the 14th of July stating that their CEO had been arrested. He held all of the keys to multi-chain. The team were therefore locked out from all of the assets and they were therefore unrecoverable and multi-chain would be shutting down. So massive news here for multi-chain. And you can see that this was tweeted by multi-chain on July the 14th, 2023. Firstly, the CEO of multi-chain was arrested and the multi-chain team couldn't access any of the funds that are on multi-chain because they were under his control. And this is a big deal. And I'm actually going to read that sentence out loud. Since the inception of the project, all operational funds and investments from investors have been under his control. So, wow. The tweets continue with a timeline. And the only thing I'm going to mention here is that multi-chain CEO's family managed eventually to log into the cloud servers using his home computer. But they kept hold of control of them rather than pass them on completely to the multi-chain team. And please feel free here to pause if you'd like to read the rest of it in its entirety. Or if you'd like to, you can check them out on X, which was formerly Twitter. Then on the 7th of July, user funds were then transferred to unknown addresses. And on the 9th of July, the CEO's sister moved the remaining user funds to a separate address or separate addresses and told the multi-chain team to essentially protect the user funds that are on there but she maintained control over these rather than pass them to the team and i can hear you screaming now De defi decentralized finance really let's continue and the final three tweets that the multi-chain team shared state that the ceo's sister was then apparently arrested on the 13th of July. The outcome of this is that because the multi-chain team have no access to the domain, the operations or the user's funds, multi-chain is essentially finished and they end with a plea to not use multi-chain under any circumstances because of what we've just looked at. And this is confirmed on CoinGecko, as you can see here, saying that the team is looking into it and is they, they've actually helpfully included a link to Multichain's Twitter post highlighted in green. And if you look at the price of Multichain's token called Multi, we're actually hitting all time lows and we've seen a, a big drop. So what's this got to do with the Beefy token? That was the title of this video. Well, Beefy as a multi-chain yield optimizer relies heavily on bridges and it relies heavily on their providers to ensure they can operate across 21 different chains, which is massive. Company Multichain, however, issued all of the bridged copies of the Beefy token. And this means that Multichain's bridging contracts on Beefy's native BNB chain held the majority of the token supply. The collapse of Multichain therefore signifies the collapse of the Beefy token. And you can see here an example of the millions of Beefy that is staked on Beefy Finance at the time of shooting this video. In fact, there's a total of over $8.3 million worth of the Beefy token staked in the top six earning pools alone, all on different networks. 
So what's Beefy going to do? For full disclosure, I don't own any Beefy and none of this contained is financial advice. It's simply education. But Beefy's plans are to redeploy and distribute the Beefy token to token holders captured at a specific time or a specified time. Beefy are also choosing now to redeploy on Ethereum and their tokenomics will stay very similar with a max supply still of 80,000 Beefy tokens. It is worth noting here that some exchanges, including the largest one in Binance, are flagging the Beefy token at the moment of being of high risk and subjected to high volatility and they're therefore warning their customers about trying to trade with it in any way. So if you are affected by this at all, Beefy Finance have set up a dedicated Beefy migration channel in Discord, so I would advise you to contact them. But I'd love to know what you think about this, so let me know in the comments below. And also, if you are looking for more of a tailored and a faster approach to your crypto education, I offer one-to-one -one coaching to people who really have the desire and the means to invest in their education. And if you are interested, just put education in the comments below and I'll get in touch to book in a free 30 minute video call. Alternatively, you can send me a DM or a message on X, formerly known as Twitter. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you got something out of this video and the content. And if you haven't already, please do like and subscribe as it helps massively. Have a great day.